Hey, I'm Elvi, and in this video I'm going to show you some useful algs for the Puppet Cube V1. I'm going to show you how they work, what they do, and how to use them. First, I'm going to show you four five cycle algs, two three cycle algs, one swapping alg, and one flipping alg. And after that, I'm also going to show you four ways of how to use these algs together to create different results. If you are struggling to get it to a cube shape, unfortunately I won't be talking about that in this video. My best tip for you would be just try until you get it, that's what I did. Make sure that whenever you're doing any of these algs have the yellow red blue corner in either the RUF position or the LUF position. I'm gonna use a blind notation uh, to show where all the pieces go so hopefully you know blind for alg1 we always start at a when starting to check pieces so a goes to l which goes to j j goes to o o to s and s back to a what this means for the puppet cube is that there are three of these five edges that we can see. Let me show you how to do this alg. You have the UBR corner at RUF and you do R prime, U prime, R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R, U. And this is what it looks like on a three by three. R prime, U prime, R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R, U. For alg 2, A goes to N, N to W, to J, J goes to R, and then back to A. For this alg, there's also three visible pieces only. Have the yellow blue corner at RUF and do R prime, U prime, R, U, R, U, R, U prime, R prime, U prime. And this is what it looks like on the three by three. R prime, U prime, R, U, R, U, R, U prime, R prime, U prime. Alg three is just the lefty version of alg2 where before you rotate d goes to h h to x to t l and then back to d so since this is a lefty alg we hold the yellow red blue corner at luf instead and do this algorithm l u L prime, U prime, L prime, U prime, L prime, U, L, U. And this is what that looks like on the 3x3. Three three. First we rotate, then do L, U, L prime, U prime, L prime, U prime, L prime, U, L, U. Rotate back. For alg4, there's also only three pieces that we can see. We start with A, which goes to N. N goes to L, which goes to I. S, and then back to A. Hold the yellow, red, blue corner at RUF. Do R, U prime, R, U, R, U prime, R2, U2, R, U prime, R prime, U prime. And this is what that looks like on the three by three. R, U prime, R, U, R, U prime, R2, U2, R, U prime, R prime, U prime. Now I'm gonna show you the two variations of the three cycle algs that we have. There's the righty one, where H goes to T, T to R, and R back to H. Then there's the lefty one where H goes to R, R to T and T back to H. This is what alg5 looks like on the puppet cube. You have these two 
on the front and then you have the one edge in the back. For the righty version, have the yellow, red, blue corner at RUF. Do R prime, U prime, R2, U, F, R, U, F2, D prime, R prime. This is what that looks like on the 3x3. R prime, U prime, R2, U, F, R, U, F2, D prime, R prime. Now for the lefty version, have the yellow, red, blue corner at the L, U, F position and do L, U, L2, U prime, F prime, L prime, U prime, F2, D and L. And this is what that looks like on the 3x3. L, U, L2, U prime, F prime, L prime, U prime, F2, D, L. Now for ALG7, the swapping algorithm, it swaps these pieces, D, T, and H and L. Have the yellow, red, blue corner at R, U, F and do R prime, U prime, R2, U prime, R prime, U2, R, U, R, U, R2, U prime, R, U, R. This is what that looks like on the 3 by 3 R prime, U prime, R2, U prime, R prime, U2, R, U, R, U, R2, U prime, R, U, R. Now this alg is very useful as when done twice, it flips all edges that are involved. Beware that these algs might flip some random pieces. So my tip is to flip pieces last. So to do a U perm on the left side, which does a clockwise U perm, you first do alg seven, then alg five, and then alg seven again. And so to do a U perm on the B side, which is counterclockwise, you just mirror that entire thing. Mirror alg seven, do that on the left side, do alg six, and then mirror alg seven again. And for the last alg I'm going to show you, D goes to X, to T, and back to D. Or if you do it with alg 5 instead of what I'm going to show you, D goes to T, to X, to D, which is just backwards. So the first step of this alg is to have the yellow, red, blue corner at L, U, F, and then do D setup moves. L, U, L2, U prime, F prime, L prime, U prime, F2, U and F. Then we rotate with a Z and then we do alg1, which is R prime, U prime, R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R, U. Then for this version, we do alg5 reversed and for this version we just do alg5 so i'm going to show you alg5 reversed which is x z r d f2 u prime r prime f prime u prime r2 u r and then we do alg1 reversed, which is u prime, r prime, u prime, r prime, u prime, r, u, r, u, r. Then we do a z prime to rotate back, and then we undo our setup moves, which is f prime, u prime, f2, u, l, f, u, L2, U prime, L prime. If you have any other questions, let me know in the comments below. Anyways, 
Thank you so much for watching. Like the video if you like the video. If you're new here, consider subscribing. It's even free. That's an insanely good price. Who even knows what I'll post next? And I even do Twitch. I might be streaming right now. Twitch.tv slash Elvis75. Thanks. Bye.